In this video, we show you a typical editing job. We remove some old text from a drawing frame and type in new text. We'll also show how to configure font type, size, angle, and other text properties. In PixEdit, we distinguish between text as comments and permanently inserted text. If you want to insert revisable text, you will need to look at the video about redaction and commenting. This video demonstrates how to remove old text and replace it with new permanent text. In contrast to text inserted as comments, which can only be saved in PDF file format, permanent text can be saved in all other types such as TIFF, JPEG, as well as PDF. The disadvantage with permanent text is it cannot be easily re-edited later. If you want to change permanent text, you must first erase it, then retype it. In the example document you now see on the screen, we will first use the Select Area tool in Object Picker mode to select then delete the old permanent text. Notice, this operation only selects the text that is automatically highlighted in blue, but not the surrounding text frames. The Object Picker only selects graphics which are not in contact with the rectangle indicating the selected area. We could have cleaned one field at a time using the Eraser tool, but here it is quicker to use the Object Picker and select all fields at once. As shown in the previous video, selected graphics can be moved, scaled, and so on. Here, however, we simply want to delete it, so press the Delete key on the keyboard. If some of the text had been in contact with the frame itself, it would have not been selected by the Object Picker. If this had happened, we would have to have removed it using the eraser. Now let's activate the text tool and indicate the position of the inserted text with a mouse click. We type in the new text and fine-tune alignment by dragging the text to its final position. By the way, text can also be pasted onto your drawing using Ctrl-C or even be dragged directly from other applications into your document. But back to our current text insertion. Before we permanently insert our text by clicking once outside the blue rectangle, text font, size, and other properties can be changed using the tool style window. Once inserted, permanent text cannot be changed. However, you can always undo the operation and start over. Just like with almost any other operation in PixEdit, area deletion and text insertion can be recorded in a macro then played back on single pages, on documents, or even entire collections of documents. This comes in handy if you need to insert a new logo or some text on entire archives. 